I don't know about you. Mm. I I'm I'm captivated now. I, I moved from the Olympics mm-hmm. to Shark Week. Oh yeah. So there's plenty of basically the last two weeks and then the following week. They stoners have three weeks of yeah. just eye candy. Yeah. <laughs> Shark filled specials. Right. You know, they went amazing. From, went from the Olympics to now Shark Week, which is just so thrilling and exciting. Mm-hmm. But in watching a whole lot of it yesterday, mm-hmm. I noticed that the programming because it's. Do you realize this is like 20 some years they've been yeah, doing this? Yeah, 25. I mean, are it's their you It's their 25th year. How is that even possible? It's crazy. I didn't know the channel was around that long. Yeah. But Shark Week continues. People love the programming, but mm-hmm. they've had to tweak it a little bit. So I'm watching and I'm captivated and I keep watching and I saw this show that they had coming up and I'm like, "All right, that one, that that may be officially going a little bit too far." Check out the preview from this upcoming Shark Week show. Shark Week continues on the Discovery Channel with the two craziest shark divers you've ever met, Pete McCormick and Paul Rowland. Look at that hammerhead! What a thing of beauty! Would you look at the tail on that thing? (sighs) My God! They just don't swim with the sharks. I don't know about you, but my wetsuit just got a lot tighter. They tried to f*** them. Oh man, a nurse shark? I mean, look at that. Look at the fins on that thing. Dude, oh, I am so gonna f*** that shark. Do it, man. F*** that shark. Shark It's all a part of Shark Week, only on Discovery. Yeah, see, that to me, it seemed like a bit much.